to our YouTube channel. I'm Cooper and behind the camera is Parker. Hi. Uh, today we are going to be showing you a Minecraft tutorial on how to build a roller coaster. And remember, if you do like this video, please, please hit the like button and subscribe. We'll see you when, when, when we do it. Bye. Okay guys, the first step obviously is to create your world. That's going to take a long time to load. It'll be alright. Green dot. Sorry guys if this isn't very good. We're trying to find a good spot where you can see everything. Okay, well first, or the second step is you want to find yourself a, like a flat area to build your roller coaster. Um, if you spawn in trees, try to find a plains like this or a mountain bi biome. <clears throat> now this is where we are running a uh, a different version, not the updates. Um, so you'll see different blocks and stuff. Well, you guys have more with the updates. But the first step is you want to grab the what the color what your color you want on your rails um, and pick that out. I'm going to use red for the demonstration. Um, this is probably pretty simple to make one but you want to place your blocks how you want it. We're not going to make a really big one like in our last video. No. I'm not, I don't really that took us forever to build. Yep, two days. Two days. And then you just want to do like your hills and stuff. So like a normal roller coaster, just do your hills up, down, up, down, and then. But you want to make sure it goes fast enough where it amazes people, like our last video. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to rocket launch it off. It'll be power rails. Um, and what you want to do halfway through is you want to start placing the rails, um, just, just for some tests of, because you don't want to get all the way through with your track and then figure out something's broken and then you have to replace the whole track. Yeah. So, you want to always test it. Get out of your sheep. Essentially, you only need one redstone torch to activate it. Yeah, it just looks cooler if you used it like that. And then, you, of course, you can customize it all you want. I'm just going to do a simple one. And then we'll, here. well, you don't have to do uh, power rails on the bottom or going back down the hill. I'm just doing that just to get a good ramp going and then what you want to do is you just want to test it um if you ever do a jump like this make sure you always have powered rails down here or it's just going to have a big stop um shoot. just like that and you want to use redstone tor torches to activate it not regular torches yeah redstone torches or since we don't have redstone blocks um, in this version, I think they took them out. Just use redstone torches. But if you're doing a red track under like this, just use redstone blocks under them. But anyways, so it jumps. It's just, mine's just going to jump. That's why I got so much speed. And if you just had rails here, you'd stop for a split second. And it just goes slow. So I'll do one more hill. Oh, and power rails can't curve. No. I'm sure half of you guys knew that, but if you didn't, that's why we're here to tell you. And you can put pillars under it if you don't want it floating like ours in the last video. <laughs> yeah. Um, and comment down below if you want us to keep doing tutorials or Minecraft worlds or what you think we should be doing. I'm just going to loop mine under this track. Now, in the last video, it didn't take us as long because we had Parker helping, but today it's just me and Parker's being the cameraman. Of course, you can't see that. Um, 
I'm not going to do a big roller coaster because I don't want it to take up most of your time of the day. When you're in a minecart, you can go through blocks. Yep, so if it's like you can't walk through the block or it's just one block uh, spacing, um, you can go through that. We haven't tested in survival if you get hurt. I'm pretty sure you might not because if you have it quick enough, you won't. We can cut to that after. Yeah. And if you want to sh want to make it look a little better, um, you can touch it up with a cur with curving, not like straight yeah. curves, just like this. It'll just curve it. And I'm just gonna curve back around to the start. And it doesn't have to be a color under your rails. It can be anything. Yeah, it can. But I would I I recommend um, the colors under it just to get it more. Sparkle or whatever. Sorry if you hear a lot of clicking. It's me using my buttons. So, anyways, um, I don't think you want to see me place all these rails. So we'll just cut once we're done. Yeah. See you soon.